Oh, hello and welcome to uh, Film Mixologist. Uh, at the moment I'm working on this uh, Lester D unit and uh, I decided to take off the top to see, to examine the condition of the bearings. Now, <laughs> show you. Uh, there we go. Ta da! Now, this doesn't look insanely great. Uh, so, what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to take this little thing like this and give it a nice little wipe and try and see if there is anything resembling a bearing there. This is disgusting. Oh, look! There is something that looks like a bearing there. Let's give it a bit more wiping. Ah, this is disgusting. It's a good job. I, uh, it's a good job I did this uh, because this is this is in. Mm, it's not that the bearing is not in great shape. It might be absolutely fine once it's cleaned and greased, but if I didn't do this, it was going to remain with all this, with all this kind of like caked oil on it. And if you look at the uh, at the cover, it's pretty much the same thing. It's disgusting. Uh, it is in good condition though, the, well, obviously because it's, it's been caked in, in this kind of oily grease um, so therefore there's no chance it was going to corrode. Silver lining of sorts. Okay, so let's try and do this. Ah! Okay, uh, that is looking much cleaner now. Let's have a look. And now what we're going to do in a minute is I'm gonna I'm gonna unleash my secret weapon for cleaning this. Uh, but for that we need to go outside because this is gonna make a real mess. Uh, show you in a minute what it is. Okay, this unit is actually quite clean now. At least this little bit. Uh, and now what I need to do is I'm gonna have to, once I clean this a bit more, I'm gonna set the camera outside, because this needs to be done outside. Uh, I'm gonna set the camera outside and I'm gonna unleash my secret weapon uh, on this unit, see if we can get the bearings, um, some sem give the bearings some semblance of fighting chance of surviving operation of this machine. So, in a minute.
we're back again inside the workshop and I think this unit cleaned out rather well um, I can see that the, that the bearing race is okay and now it's it's free from all that kind of disgusting crud and also if you look at this this little window in here it it does look a lot cleaner than what it was obviously we're still having a bit of kind of debris uh, kind of coming out of it but I think but now this um, this crankcase assembly is um, it's 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 in it's in good shape. So what I'm what I'm going to do, I'm not going to change the bearings on this uh, because I think the the bearings are reusable. Um, and the only thing I'm going to do is I'm going to clean them up. Uh, I'm going to grease them up in in a in a in a bit, and that should be you know sufficient. And this is ready for for reassembly. And and yeah, this should be good enough. Obviously, I need to be very careful not to um, not to damage uh, this end bit here. And this is is for the camshaft as well. This spins freely, and there's just a little bit of. But the crankshaft spins really well. Um, there's a bit of grinding noise maybe I still got like a bit of that old oil but most of it has gone by means of that treatment with the with the paraffin and the compressed air that got rid of most of the of the bad stuff so what I'm going to do now is I'm gonna put this back on momentarily I think a gasket should go here anyway I'm going to put it back on momentarily, and then um, at some other point, I'm going to I'm going to clean it properly.